heads up. You guys might get mad for what I'm doing. Uh, I know a lot of you guys got mad with the how to break a bike chain video and like whatever, so it doesn't matter. Um, I like figuring things out, making my own stuff, and well, yo, what's up, guys? Um, so today I'm working on a, converting a mountain bike into a, a beach cruiser. So recently I was looking for a beach cruiser that belonged to my dad, and um, it seems I couldn't find it in our backyard. I guess somebody must have snuck in and taken it. Um, it's no big deal. Find another one. Um, so I'm converting this this mountain bike that we had lying around here. It's it's a good it's a good frame. Um, so well, let me show you what I'm doing. So this is what I'm doing right here. So you can see I got all the parts laid out here. A uh, bunch of random stuff. I'm trying to waste as little money as possible in this build. So most of the stuff that I'm going to be making. I'm building, using to build this bike. I'm making it myself. So, so what I'm doing, I had this All City steel fork lying around. So I'm gonna use it. Um, it's a one-inch fork, threadless. And so what I did, you guys might laugh at this. So what I did, I I decided to just one second. Okay, check this out. So originally, for some of those uh, new head sets, it comes with this. Let me see if we can focus. Well, it has this inner thing already inside, which I can't take out. And it's for like one of these things, you know, you put on the headset and like it does that kind of thing, right? All right, there you go. So it's, it has one of these things that I haven't been able to uh, take out because I already put it in there for the purpose of this one. For my old bike, I had a fixie and I ended up not using that fixie anymore. So I uh, took it apart, have it for this now. And so yeah, so what I did, this is this part was from this old BMX bike that I had. So I had this, I chopped, I chopped it off a little bit so I could have some sort of pressing system. Then I found this, this, this bolt lying around in my shed and it actually fits perfectly with, um, with the type of uh, threading it has. So hopefully it's working. So all I need to do or find, all I need to find to make this work is a piece, I can hold it down. So I'm trying to file down the thread, the threads right here, so it could go in smoothly. Another thing that I'm trying to do, because I need more spacers, I'm gonna need more spacers because this thing goes inside and I need a one inch tubing to go on top here. So I'm gonna need more spacers to go all the way on top and then that should work. <laughs> that should work and hopefully I'll have a new beach cruiser. 